here we go. Breakfast of champions. Egg whites with some pepper, but this is the part of my breakfast you're gonna really, really love. Oh, kidney beans and asparagus. My dog's like, I'll eat some of that. Give it to me. But it's definitely not super tasty. I put a different um, flavor god on it every day. Today I'm doing Cajun Lovers. Uh, I just, I switch it up. But I just put that on the beans and the asparagus. Today is a lower carb day, obviously, based on what I'm eating. Um, so this is breakfast. Then I get veggie chicken. Um and some asparagus throughout the day every three hours with this meal again to complete my evening and my washing machine is like on the cleaning the tub cycle so it's kind of loud if you hear that but anyway yeah so if you want to prep just realize breakfast isn't going to be always great so if you like to have a good old morning breakfast with some pancakes or oatmeal probably not going to happen Okay, I do frozen asparagus a lot just out of convenience, but it is much better to do the real thing. So if I have time, I will do uh, fresh asparagus. It's actually about the same price because a bag, an eight ounce bag of asparagus is $3.99 frozen. And this is $5 already pre-cut and washed and everything. And it's uh, $5. So it's a dollar more, but you're getting two ounces more. So anyway, this is how I do it. I just put down some spray just some Pam, uh, just so they don't stick. And then I use a little black pepper with my chicken. And then I also use a little bit of uh, lemon juice. So I just kind of squeeze the lemon juice, drip it. We'll get it all over there. Cause I'm not supposed to have a lot of fat and stuff. So I'm not supposed to use any oil. Uh, really, but you don't want it to stick. So, and you want also this garlic um, flavor to kind of stick to it, and the lemon juice helps it stick to it. So, I just do that. I preheat my oven to uh, 425 and I leave it in there for 13 minutes. It comes out really good, so much better than the slimy stuff that you get in the frozen bags. But they serve a purpose. If you're in a hurry, just throw that bag in there for five minutes in the microwave, and you got asparagus. But this is better if you have time. All right, here's three meals for today. Those are those Curin uh, cutlets. Um, they do not have soy, so depending on if you have a soy issue, you can have these. They do have egg in them though, so if you're vegan, not a good option. With my asparagus, I put a different flavor on each just so it, it pretty much all tastes the same. But this one's Taco Tuesday since it's a Tuesday. This one is Garlic uh, Lovers. And then this one over here is Chipotle. So whatever, just a little different. So I eat one of these at 12.30, 3.30, and 6.30. And then I have my kidney beans, asparagus, and egg whites for breakfast. Yay! Oh, meal prepping is so tasty. All right, I'm going to start this video by taking my convertible top down. This thing is pretty cool. So I got a button here. And basically, this one's for the windows, and this one's for the little visor thing. But I pull on this. Windows go down on their own. The back opens. And it goes down. Woo! -hoo. And then it beeps. Then I put up the windows and I put up this little wind guard because it's not super warm. What's the temperature? I don't even. Oh. It's 61, so it's not very warm, but check it out. Our barn is gone. That's why I can't draw, I can't roller skate inside because we have nothing to put the stuff, nowhere to put it, other than this Connex box and this garage, which is where I roller skate normally, but I can't. And then, um, yeah, it's just a super beautiful convertible day. It's my sun car, it's super fun. And then I got my snow car over there who's been extra reliable. That car is 11 years old this September and she is going strong. That's Bella the Benz and this is Rosie the Roadster. She is a SL, fun stuff. Oh, I got the auto on. I always turn this off guys cause it's really annoying. All right, on my way to work. All right, hi everybody. I'm just getting a workout in at the rink. It's really hard for me to stay motivated 
to work out like in a gym setting, even though this rink has everything I need to work out. Um, when my students here and then I skate when that's over with, I'm just kind of done and I leave. But today I'm working out in here, even though I have all my weights and everything I need, but um, I decided I didn't want to go to the gym today <laughs> after I left here. Um, and then I have my dress fitter coming. We're changing my pair's costume into a unitard because the skirt was throwing me off on the throws. It was like throwing off my balance. So anyways, the downfall to working out here is sometimes, because I work here, sometimes I'll, I'll, like, I'll have a parent or something that I'll end up interrupting a workout, but also too, it's freezing. So you have to wear like 900 layers. Um, anyway, so I'm just gonna do some jumping jacks, get warmed up and do some arms, mainly calisthenics. I do have some weights, but nothing too heavy. This mask does not like to stay on. anybody worried about Johnny he is back out and walking around with a little snowflake again his wings a little stiff though you can tell but he can jump up on things uh morning everybody I literally just woke up like I look wonderful but anyway I'm just finishing week five so I'm headed into um the final month which is where you really have to get hardcore um, and I need to do a little better this week at not snacking on like strawberries and things. I had an apple on Thursday because it was a low carb day and I was feeling it and I wanted to skate. So I had an apple. It was small, but still it's not my meal plan. And then I had probably like six or seven strawberries throughout the week. And let's see, I had a couple of chips because one of the ladies at the rink had some chips open. I grabbed a couple of chips and then I had like a two part cheat meal. I had like veggie sushi and then um, I had some pasta, but it was all at home stuff. It was nothing that I went out for. So it's actually probably a little bit better for me. Um, and then I had uh, some macaroons and ice cream with that. Normally I just do like the ice cream or the macaroons, but I did both. And then I had a little bowl of pasta, but I wanted pasta because I'm growing basil and oregano in my garden. And so I wanted that. So I did that, but then I wanted this veggie sushi. I saw at the grocery store. So I got that because they don't always have the veggie sushi. Sometimes they just have the stuff with the fish. So I was like, well, I want that. So I had that. Anyway, otherwise I've been doing good. I've been doing all my workouts. I've been getting to the gym more. Um, there's a new rule where you don't have to wear a mask if you're vaccinated and I'm vaccinated, but my gym still requires it. So not probably not my personal like small gym because they know everybody there. So it's easier, but the big gym, no. So I haven't been to see my coach though this week. So I'll go next week and I'll see what his rules are. Um, the ice rink, if you're fully vaccinated, does not make you wear a mask now, which is very nice. Um, but we'll see. It's kind of, people can lie. So I don't know what the rule is. So confusing, but so this week, um, I would not next week. I will not do what I did this week. This week, I will make sure I don't eat extra on my cheat meal and I don't have a random fruit in the middle of the week. Cause the whole point of this is to deplete your carbs. But I am noticing that I am getting a little bit thinner, like my legs, because my legs are usually the last thing and like my calves and stuff. Like I am getting thinner and my abs, I am like they are getting better. But I know 
I know, I know I can do better. So I'm going to, and I'm videoing this weird. So it might not look like I'm looking at the camera because the camera's like down here. Um, but because of the lighting, it just worked better. So if it looks like I'm not looking at you, that is why. I have a lot of random little short clips this video. Sorry, it's not like a long, really not much has changed. My food stayed the same. My workout stayed the same. I see my coach this Friday. That's when things will probably change. It'll be a little bit more exciting. But anyway, I will see you guys in the next video.